It's practically impossible. There's nowhere to park. It's ridiculous. Parking in Charlotte can be a hassle, and sometimes even a quick trip inside can lead to a ticket on your car. I have to make a thousand circles. You're trying to find a place. You're pro you don't know like the garages and stuff. You don't want to pay crazy amounts for anything, so it's just really difficult. I think the city should give people opportunity in parking lots where you, they can allow to accommodate with the growth of the city. The Charlotte Department of Transportation is developing a strategic parking plan. The city says the plan will recommend ways to efficiently manage the curb lane and balance competing needs for access, including loading and parking needs. It has five goals, enhance, advance, promote, balance and maximize. The on-street parking and curb lane management program includes a number of things, including five managed parking districts in Charlotte. That's South End, Plaza Midwood, Elizabeth, Noda, and Uptown. The plan also includes curb lane compliance of all on-street parking. That's metered and non-metered spaces like these in the residential parking permit program and loading zones. But the new initiative has some neighbors skeptical. They literally just said that there's 10,000 people coming in per year. You can't get enough parking for that, especially when you got buildings coming up left and right and apartments coming up left and right. How are you going to fill those people? Like, how are you, how are you going to cover that parking when there's 30 people going to be on one floor. It's never going to happen. The city is taking input as they assess the on-street parking system to better develop a plan for better curb lane access for everyone. City officials say this also is the first of several engagement opportunities over the coming months and through 2023. Reporting in Charlotte, Shakira Speaks, Queen City News.